Good afternoon. I'm Dr. Kamal Shahrabi, RIT Kosovo President and Dean of Faculty. It is my great pleasure to welcome you all to RIT Kosovo Commencement Ceremony Chira. First and foremost, in the midst of these difficult and uncertain times, I hope you and your loved one are staying healthy and safe. The spread of coronavirus has been disruptive to us all, especially for you who with much anticipation concluded your study and preparing for employment or graduate school. You have long dis anticipated this day, possibly with eagerness, with anxiety, or with a complex mix of emotion. But whatever you are feeling here today, you have earned a keen sense of pride. You have made it. Congratulations. A college graduation and milestone to be celebrated by all graduating class and their families. It is a time of personal victory, achievement, and hope for future. Our principal responsibility, however, is to keep the campus community safe during this public health emergency. That requires taking a step that assures the well-being of all of us. It is with great regret that the college has made the difficult decision to postpone the on-campus commencement ceremony scheduled for today, May 13, 2020. It was not easy to make this decision. We know you want an on-campus commencement. We do too. This virtual celebration does not take the place of that. It has been my honor to work in an institution with such a rich and hopeful legacy, with colleagues from a faculty and a staff who are deeply committed to our success in providing an outstanding American education through innovation curricula, experiential, and research in a student-centered culture that builds expertise, knowledge, and value that prepare RIT graduates to contribute to global society. Certainly, your family and friend who are celebrating with you today take tremendous pride in your achievement. And do the many people around the world who are with us virtually through all live streaming of today's ceremony. Another group taking great pleasure in today's events are RIT Kosovo Outstanding Faculty. I work with these dedicated professors closely in my role as a president and dean of faculty. And I know firsthand the great satisfaction and pride they feel in your accomplishment. We are proud of you and your achievement. And we look forward to the day when we can again celebrate your achievement together in campus. Congratulations, class of 2020. Hello, I'm Ellen Granberg, RIT Provost and Senior Vice President for Academic Affairs. Welcome to this celebration of the class of 2020. I deeply regret that we are not gathered together in Prishna, but I am still excited to have the opportunity to celebrate each of you and acknowledge your success. This pandemic has changed the lives of everyone, and nobody knows that more than this graduating class. Commencement is perhaps the most cherished occasion in the life of our university. I'm sure that when you first started classes at RIT Kosovo and pictured your commencement, the day you would celebrate all of your hard work and academic achievements, you didn't envision yourself connecting to a video conference call without your classmates, professors, and extended family nearby. So a lot has changed, but what hasn't changed is RIT's uniqueness and how innovation is integrated into everything we do. RIT prides itself in preparing our graduates not only for jobs and careers, but also for life and all of its challenges. Today, even more than ever, the world needs people who know how to create and innovate 
analyze and implement, collaborate and lead. We need people who will use their resiliency, ingenuity, education and skills to make the world a better place. You, the class of 2020, are those people here in Kosovo and around the globe. The way I see it, disruption births opportunity. And over the last eight weeks, I have seen countless examples of RIT Kosovo students doing just that. From an academic perspective, you excelled at online and remote learning. You negotiated which room you'd study in while others in your home used separate spaces. You created a new schedule and workflow that helped you finish the semester. And you found a way to balance your academic and personal worlds coming together. In simply adjusting to this unexpected change, you have accomplished a lot, but many of you went even further finding ways to take this event and turn it into new opportunities for learning and connection. In the RIT Kosovo Introduction to Psychology class, the students created animated videos to encourage healthy behavior during the quarantine. I have no doubt that many of you have also turned this challenge into similar learning experiences in your coursework and that you will carry that forward. Our global connectivity also never missed a beat. The RIT Kosovo student government co-hosted online events to engage students at all campuses, such as cooking classes, live music, and stand-up comedy. Your student government donated part of its budget to international students who were stuck in Pristina in isolation and in need of supplies. You held online town forums in honor of Earth Awareness Month and Genocide Awareness and Prevention Month. RIT Kosovo student government is also printing 3D, 3D printing protection equipment to donate to the University Clinical Center of Kosovo. Let me say you are incredible. Your ability to bring people together virtually, to share their talents, to support one another in these most challenging times, and to strengthen our global connectedness is inspiring. This month, we have approximately 4,300 students earning diplomas globally, including more than 40 PhD students. You are joining a network of 135,000 alumni throughout the world, working at the top of their fields and giving back to their communities. Not surprisingly, our alumni have stepped up during this pandemic. RIT alums from around the world are doing their part to combat this illness. Their contributions range from leading major field hospital sites in New York City, to creating new businesses that are supplying critical resources to hospitals around the world. The list goes on and on because goodness is a part of our DNA. And so is rising to the challenge and never giving up. You are joining fellow graduates from our campuses in Dubai, Croatia, China, and Rochester all who have had their lives altered by the coronavirus. You, the class of 2020, will always be the class that not only survived the rigorous coursework, research, and co-op programs, but you completed your education during a pandemic. You are the class that already has answered the call to make the world a better place. We hope you celebrate all the challenges you have overcome, the goals you have reached, and the lifelong friendships you have made. Everyone at RIT is so proud of you. Today, we want you to focus on good memories and to reflect on all that you have accomplished. Wherever you choose to be and wherever you go, be proud of your roots. Be proud of who you are, and remember that you are and always will be an RIT Tiger. Congratulations to the class of 2020. Hello everyone, uh, I'm Ron Kami, Udan Sami. Uh, I'm the chair of the uh, AUK. Uh, on behalf of the entire board, 
our colleagues in the staff, administration, Dr. Sharabi, congratulations. Budima, today you graduate. Uh, I know we're all very sad about the fact that we're having this uh, ceremony, if I can call it that, uh, via the internet <laughs> rather than in person. Uh, I know all of us on the board look forward to this day very, very much. It's one of the happiest days of the year for us. To see all your smiling faces and all the joy of your parents and loved ones with you, I have to say especially to see, for me, to see your parents uh, as a parent myself uh, happy on this occasion is something we miss very much. Um, when one, ver one simple word of advice as you go forward on this uh, journey post-graduation, uh, stay positive, uh, look on this experience as something that's unique and not negative. You're gonna remember this graduation much more than I remember mine uh, uh, because it's so unique. Uh, but I think stay positive, uh, get to work. Uh, don't let negativity impact you and the glorious futures you have in front of you. Uh, you have all the tools you need now to go and lead a successful life. Uh, and without much further ado, it's my uh, pleasure and responsibility to introduce the next speaker. Uh, I want to introduce him by reminding everyone that the AUK as a private institution was founded on the back of the Kosovar people. Uh, if you go back to our original founding more than uh, 20 years ago now, when it really started as an idea, it was the Kosovar community and the funds they put forward that launched AUK. So for us on the board, it's always important at these events to have someone uh, congratulate you on behalf of the Kosovar people uh, because it was the Kosovar people that started it all. And so I'm, without uh, much further ado, it's my pleasure to introduce the person who will do that. He's the current Prime Minister of Kosovo, uh, Zotni Albin Kurti. Uh, and without that, uh, please uh, stay safe. God bless you all. And remember to kiss your parents uh, tonight to thank them for all they've done for you. God bless. Përshëndetje të gjithve të dashur student të Institutit Rochester Teknologjis në Kosovë. Do të doja që tani të isha aty pranë jush që të drejtosha dhe në të njëtën kol të shihja në fytyr se cilin nga ju. Po ja që pandemia të cilin ne po e përjetojmë në pa mund sanë këtë, andaj gjeja me ofërt që me knajsi dhe me ndere mund të bëj, është ju drejtojmë për mes këti video inqizimi. Sot, ju do të pajiseni me diplom ku të regohet se ju keni përfunduar me sukses studimet universitare dhe kjo është të vërtetuar me nënshkrimet dekanve dhe me një vullmbita. Êshtë arritje e madhe dhe duhet të ndijeni shumë krenar, por ajo diplom nuk në nënkupton barimin e studimeve të oja. Naturisht se disa probleme që keni pasur gjatë studimeve do të përfundojnë me sotë ma nuk keni nevoj të ankoheni për parkingu në pamjaftueshë me asë ushqimi në shtrajt kantinës. Por 4 vitet e kaluara kanë qenë vetëm një bazë për të arritur gjëra edhe më të mëdha në jetë, pra ishte një loj studimi mbi studimi. E pjesa më e ma dhe e kësa jetë është duke ju pritur, dhe ajo ka shumë gjëra për të mesuar nëse ju dëni dhe e lejoni. Periulla pas fakultetit do të kjetë po ashtë në mos edhe ma shumë mundësi për studiuar. Përve se do të vazhdoni të mësoni si të dini, learning to know, do të përplasini me shumë mësime tjera, si të bëni, si të jeni dhe si tjetoni me njëri tjetëri. Njërëzit mësojnë gjatë gjithë jetës styre, nga djepi në varë, mësojnë dhe jetojnë paralelisht. E këto mësime që në ofrën jeta, ne duhet të mirë presi. Ti interpretojmë, ti analizojmë, ti përvecojmë. Sokrati pa të thënë që jeta e pa egzaminuar nuk vlen tjetohet. Një kosisht ju keni dhe një përgjësi tjetër. Dia që ju e keni fituar gjatë këtyre viteve, aftësit dhe përgaditja juaj e tanishme, ju bëjnë juve ndërve primtarët matë fuqishëm të ndryshimit në vendin të. RIT është njëndër universitetet matë mirat vendit, dhe unë mendoj se një arsuje për këtë është që RIT Kosova ka ndërtuar një model që kalon nga mësimi si të dim, të një loj tjetëri mësimit si të bëjmë, duke dëtyruar që ju të përfundoni 400 orë pun praktike. 
puna që të fakultetit mund duke të konceptit thjeshtë, por me ndoj se është një ndër aspektet ma transishme të studimit. Dhe rezultatet flasin vetë. Afer 90% të të diplomuarve nga RIT gjenë pun në një shtetë ku pa punësia e trive është dyfish ma e madhe se shkala e përgjithshme e pa punësis, e shkala e përgjithshme e pa punësis tashmë është shumë e lartë, si që di. Andaj, mos haroni se diploma që po merë një sot është privilegj dhe përgjithsi. Dhe përgjithsia sociale është në proporcion me privilegjit individuale. Sa ma të privilegjuar individualisht, duhet të adin që kemi aqë më shumë përgjithsi kolektivisht. E di që kjo, që po thëjmë tani, mund t'ju shkaktoj pak angth. Shpesh gjenja në Kosovë të bënë ndiësh i pafuqishëm. Gjdo javë ndodhën kriza treja, politike, shëndetsore, ekonomike, sociale, ma djetë ndërgëmdare. Shumë lehtë këto ndodhëi dhe grupet pas tyre mund të nga bindin se ndryshimi nuk është i mundër. Por unë besoj që duhet të bindin e që nuk është ashtu. Kosova shumë më ndikueshme dhe ndryshueshme se sa që ju me ndani. Edhe individualisht, por sidomos kur bëhen i bashkë, jeni shumë atë fëqishë. Kjo është ndërmësimet ma të rëndësishme që kam suar dhe rritani. Kur i vetëm, mund të bashkë shumë pak, por bashkë gjithë shka është e mundër. Mangësia juaj është forca e dikuj tjetër dhe anasjetës. Pra ndaj, kur bëhen i bashkë, nga bashkësia, linë shpresa dhe vjenë ndryshimi. Para 23 viteve, kur po studioj në Fakultetin Elektoteknikës të Universitetë Prishtinës, filluan protestat pashësore studentëve. Për mua, si për gjithë, ishte një kohë ndryshimi, organizimi masiv dhe rezistence qytetare por edhe kohë pasiguri. Fatë keqësisht edhe ju sot po diplomani në një kohë me pasiguri, po nisë një rukëtimin tuajt punësimit dhe të pavarësimit në mes të një krize shëndetsore globale. E ardhmja mund të ju shqetsoj tani, ashtu si shmë ka shqetsuar mua dhe prindri tuaj kur ne ishim të ri. Por puna juaj, vendimet që i merni, mënyra se si jetoni, votoni, dashuroni, protestoni, kryoni, konsumoni, të gjitha kanë dikim për të imaginatës suaj të gjitha ato mundësojnë ndryshimin dhe nasilin ma ofër një shëqërije që e duam dhe që e mëri të në popli. Pra kjo është misioni juaj. Gjatë rukëtimi tuaj, ju të të ndjeni gëzimin e suksesit, por edhe dëshprimin e dështimit. Jeta dhe të gëdet shumë nga një herë dhe pam shërshë. Por gabimit të cilat do t'i bëni, do t'i jeni një hartë më e qartë e më ilustruar e ëndrës që ju jeni duke ndjekur. Këto gabime në vete mbaj një fuqi që t'ju shëndrojnë një person më të mirë se që keni qenë më herët. Vazhdoni me besimin e palikundur në drejtim të ndrave tuaja dhe jetoni jetën të cilën e keni imaginuar. Thjesht, mos bëni kompromis me dëshira tuaja. Dua t'ju lë me një këshil të fundit. Edhe unë kam qenë me fat, ashtu sigur se ju që po diplomoni nga kolegji. Mos e haroni origjinën e fatit. Fakti që jetët tona nuk janë tërsish dhe gjithmonë në kontrolin tonë. Jetët tona janë rezultati mundimit, përpjekjeve, djersës, gjakut dhe sakrificave të prindrëve dhe gjyshërve tonë dhe prindrëve gjyshërve të tyre dhe gjitha tyre që jetonin e edhe para tyre. Ti e këtu sepse ata vepronin dhe nuk dërzohëshë. Tash ju duhet të vepronin. Kjo është koha për gëzim dhe kjo është vendi unë pra vendi për përparim. Ju falenderoj që mëftuat të flasot, urime dhe ju prift e mira dhe e mbara. I am Dr. Jim Myers, RIT Socio Provost of International Education and Global Programs. As Provost Granberg said, none of us envisioned ourselves virtually celebrating the class of 2020. But in true RIT fashion, when we see an obstacle, we overcome it. By using resources like Zoom to facilitate most of our courses, there were more than 51,000 virtual class sessions across our Rochester and global campuses. Participants joined in from more than 125 nations, including Kosovo, Dubai, Croatia, and China, as well as Kazakhstan, Fiji, Uruguay, and more. And through it all, even though we were working remotely, we were still connected. Now you have completed your final exams, participated in final online presentations, turned in your last papers. You are about to become an RIT alum. RIT Kosovo has prepared you well, but you should remember that this is not the end, but the beginning of your education. The most successful graduates are those who continue to learn throughout life. 
Many of you may still be facing uncertainty in the near future, particularly given the challenges facing us all around the world. What lies ahead will depend on us. For the coming year, we will be challenged to continuously reimagine, reimagine our spaces, our interactions, and expectations in a post-COVID world. As we do this, I think it is important for us to have faith both in ourselves and in our family, friends, and colleagues. Have faith in the fortitude and resiliency of the humankind. We will continue to find new ways to stay virtually connected until we can once again travel and explore hand in hand. The economic cost and the aftermath of social anxiety will be with us for a while. It will require us to be creative and non-traditional in our thinking. The challenges we will face should inspire us to be innovative rather than defensive. If we have learned anything from this pandemic, it is that our health and well-being depends on the health and well-being of people well beyond our shores. The collective human response to protecting each other, our wearing of masks to protect our neighbors and friends, our willingness to social distance from loved ones, the bravery of our first responders and healthcare professionals, all of these beautiful human responses should inspire and reassure us that people understand and value human interconnectedness. So what lies ahead will depend on how well we adapt, how well we innovate, how well we communicate our values. With this in mind, I ask you to be thinking about the priorities and opportunities that might emerge in this new landscape. We have nothing to lose and much to gain from working together for the betterment of all. As you embark on your next chapter, Please also take a moment to reflect on all of your achievements and remember the people who helped you along the way. The faculty have uniquely prepared you with coursework and experiential learning. The staff have guided you. Your family and friends have been there to support you. And all of us together celebrate your success. Once again, congratulations and best wishes to all of the 2020 RIT Kosovo graduates. Good afternoon, I'm Jim Hall, Dean of University Studies and Executive Director of the School of Individualized Study here at RIT. We are so sad that I'm not able to be with you today and Christina and celebrate all of you and uh, your good work. I am grateful, however, to still have the honor of recognizing so many of you and your incredible achievements. Today, 16 of you will be honored for your hard work and dedication to your academic studies recognized through the RIT Kosovo Honors Program and the RIT Outstanding Undergraduate Scholar Award. First, let me introduce RIT Kosovo's honor students. The RIT Kosovo Honor Society is designed to further challenge and engage some of its highest academically achieving students. These students participate in research, professional development, civic engagement, and it's my pleasure to announce their names. Emma Baruku, Aurora Busai, Rina Bulici, Hannah Halili, Rezarta Yahiu, Agnesa Yashare, Ibrahim Yatulahi, Ardian Kachniku, Edita Keravidai, Leonita Krasnici, Diala Luli, Raimonda Mazurk, Vesa Rakitsa, Malisa Uka, Goethe Imare, Urime to all of you. Congratulations, we're so proud of you. It's also my honor to announce the five students selected for the RIT Outstanding Graduate Undergraduate Scholar Award. Each of these students has achieved the distinction of maintaining a minimum institute grade point average of 3.85 out of a possible 4.0. It's remarkable. Their excellence, though, is not limited to academic achievements. The RIT Outstanding Scholar recognition is reserved for those students who also stand out because of their passion for learning. They're critical thinkers and leaders in the classroom. And in addition, many of these scholars have participated in student clubs, civic activities, work full or part-time, and collaborate with faculty on research projects. These students have also been recognized here at RIT at the campus in Rochester and will be eventually awarded a medallion to honor their achievements. I'm proud to announce the names of these remarkable students. Ibrahim Yahut Yatulahi, Ardian Kachniku, Adita Kervidai, Shkelchim Lokanai, Melissa Uka. So proud of all of you, so appreciative of all you've done for us. 
Last but certainly not least, I have the pleasure of introducing the RIT Kosovo valedictorian, Ibrahim Yatulahi. Ibrahim has earned his bachelor's degree in applied arts and sciences with concentrations in management and entrepreneurship and economics and statistics, and a minor in public policy. He's the recipient of the United States Kosovo Diplomatic Observer Mission Scholarship, the RIT Outstanding Undergraduate Scholar Award, the RIT Kosovo Ambassador Scholarship, and the RIT Kosovo Outstanding Student Scholarship. During his studies, he has worked in multiple RIT Kosovo offices, including the Office of Admissions, the Academic Support Center, and Human Resources. Ibrahim has also worked as an HR assistant at IPCO Telecommunications. He's been engaged in different clubs at RIT Kosovo, such as the Charity Club, Environmental Club, the Economist Club, and is the founder of the RIT Kosovo Management and Entrepreneurship Club. Ibrahim is very passionate about strategic management, data processing and analysis, development studies, human resources management and project management. And Ibrahim is eager to pursue an MS degree in strategic management. Congratulations, Ibrahim, on all of your incredible RIT academic career. And congratulations to all of the graduates of 2020. We're so proud of you. Urime. Again, we hope better days ahead. We know there's probably hard times for you and your family right now, but we are confident, we're optimistic that things will be better soon. We look forward to you staying part of the RIT family, and we look forward to celebrating face to face again soon. Take care and be well. Hello, everyone. I am Ibrahim, the valedictorian of this year's graduating class. I would like to congratulate all the seniors of the class of 2020 who have successfully completed their undergraduate studies at RIT Kosovo. Dear class of 2020, RIT Kosovo has certainly been like a second home to all of us. We were connected there through our studying materials, exams, faculty, staff, and even the environment of RIT Kosovo. During the past four years, we have studied business and economics, maths and psychology, art and literature, coding, international relations and politics, and on top of that, we had to complete two co-ops in order to successfully graduate from RIT Kosovo. The theoretical and practical lessons that you have taken from your classes and from your professional experiences have made you an invaluable asset, not only to yourself and to your families, but also to your community and to your country. During the past four years, I have heard from many of you about your future dreams and aspirations such as opening your own businesses, engaging in politics, being a programmer, and also pursuing master's degrees in the top universities across the world. I am sure that every one of you will accomplish these objectives because you have been prepared for them in the best way possible during the last four years. The class of 2020 has been one of the most successful that RIT Kosovo has had in the past years. We have been the class with the highest number of honor students, 15 in total, we have planned and organized many events, and we have changed the campus for our active leadership in the student government. I know that every senior has been eagerly waiting for our May 13th commencement, and it's very sad that it's not happening. However, I remain optimistic that the RIT Kosovo faculty and staff, together with the help of the student government, will find a suitable date for us to organize our traditional commencement ceremony. Whenever this ceremony happens, I hope that every one of you will join with your fellow classmates to celebrate your achievements. Again, congratulations on successfully finishing your undergraduate studies at RIT Kosovo, and best of luck to your future endeavors. Hope to see all of you very soon. Thank you very much. Actually something I didn't expect, but uh, cool, I think, starting from home. <laughs> and heartbroken and the way it doesn't feel real graduating this way. I hope we don't graduate online. I hope we get a, at least a ceremony or something. But even if it does, I'm not happy about it. It doesn't feel so good because I was expecting uh, something different and something else and now it turned out to be this way, but it was unexpected and that there is nothing else to do, just... Expected feeling, but nevertheless, it's a good one because we, as finally, we are accomplishing something. It feels underwhelming. Maybe uh, you expected that you would do that, but whatever. It's a crisis now. Okay. 
the whole situation has been unexpected, so we were all waiting for the graduation ceremony. However, as long as we are safe and we are expecting graduation to happen in August, hopefully, I guess it's all okay. It's weird, but also interesting and nevertheless something to be remembered. <laughs> um, it's not the best feeling out there, but at least at least we are graduating graduating after all but it's it's not the same though it's not the same it's a bit um, frustrating if i can say so because for the four for four years we were waiting for our graduation and being part of others graduation it was quite interesting and i was so enthusiastic waiting for my graduation ceremony to happen and now that we are about to graduate online it's a bit disappointing but i it's like the least thing that we can do and i hope that all of us are just going to be fine and in good health and that the situation passes. I was not happy about this situation at all because I was expecting the graduation ceremony, the rehearsal and everything. And I was really excited about that. I was waiting for that to happen. And now we're just graduating online, but I really hope in the near future we will do the graduation. So hope is keeping me alive. <laughs> I think like the vibe, because uh, I feel like RITK has a really special vibe. It's like it's like really calm and, and, and really like happy and relaxed. So I'm going to miss the vibe of the RITK parties and also um, drinking my morning coffee at the canteen with my besties laughing and stuff. Yeah, the everyday routine. The community and the network spending my breaks with my best friends because uh, now that the graduation is almost here I started to think like that uh, I won't have the opportunity to meet them every day and have them in my classes have their support and everything so I think that's what I'll miss the most the professors my friends and also our canteen's coffee I'll probably miss canteen and Catching up with friends in canteen, talking about grades, profit, and all of that. I would say the people. It's not more about the stuff that I learned because the majority you can learn everywhere. I would say the people there. Yeah, that's what I will miss the most. Thing that I will miss the most, which is something that I'm actually missing right now in this time, is the long lunches with friends um, when we had. Uh, lunch breaks two to three hours in between classes. I'm not sure about that because I think uh, I will have to wait until I, I, I leave RIT Kosovo to know what I'm going to miss. So right now, I'm not sure. Definitely I'll miss those finals week that I mentioned. I've already started missing them considering that we'll be graduating online this but uh, also my friends. I will miss its energy, the students, the professors. I will miss the late nights working at, studying at AUK, studying first in the library, and then when the library gets closed, we have to go to another class, waste our time, order food, eat junk food all, all the, during the, our studying sessions. Yeah, it's, oh, it's so sad. Adin Music, Agnesa Yashori, highest honors, Alban Krasnici, Albin Bilali, high honors, Aldenis Krasnici, Alena Mustafa, Altin Musliu, Antoneta Azemi Honors, Antoni Matias Niemi, Arbis Fonici, Ardian Kachaniku, Highest Honors, Ardit Goshi, Highest honors. 
Ardit Krasnici. Argenda Miftari. Arian Marini. Arian Smokai. Arion Goshi. Arlind Lola. Art Haliti. Artur Lejai. Aurora Buchai. Hai Sanus. Besnik Tovarlani. Hai Honors. Bestar Osmani. Dafin Fetahu. Denis Ibishi. Denisa Salihu. De Santila Murici. Diela Lulai Highest Honors. Diel Zagetsi. Dorart Abazi. Drin Murturi. Drinas Hoja. Driton Isufi. Edita Karavidai, Highest Honors. Edolind Vishai. Edon Goshi. Edona Fazliu. El Dabrada. Emma Baraku. Highest Honors. Endrit Nikchi, High Honors. Endrit Goshi. Eris Bosniaku. Flutra Abdullahu. Gelonida Bayraktari, Honors. Gens Cherimi, Honors. Gentora Demi. Gerta Umeri, Highest Honors. Highest Shal Kim. Hana Halilai, Highest Honors. Hekuran Hajia, Honors. Ibrahim Yetullahi. Highest Honors. Ilir Fetahai. Jakob Weissman. Leonita Krasnici. Highest Honors. Liridona Yusai. Lirika Krasnici. High Honors. Lirza Dolomaya. Luan Haradinai. Marko Savic. Melissa Uka. Hai Sanos. Mika Bintz. Noel Jerzai. Alt Yaku. Cendrema Ivazi, Raimonda Majuric, Highest Honors, Riyad Binaku, Rina Bulici, Highest Honors, Rinor Seydiu, Rita Malici, Rita Mehmeti, Rezarta Dobrunai, Rezarta Yahiu, Highest Honors, Saranda Sadikai, 
Shkelcim Lachanaj, Highest Honors. Shibdona Janova, Highest Honors. Stefan Stojanovic. Tringa Kasneci. Vesa Osmani Honors. Vesa Rechica, Highest Honors. We have reached a moment that all of you are waiting for. But first, let's take a moment and thank those individuals who have supported you through this journey. Without their support and sacrifice, this would have been much more difficult and challenging. Now let's do something that has never been done before virtually at RIT or RIT Kosovo, the official conferral of degrees. By the authority vested in me by the Board of Regent of the State of New York and the Board of Trustee of Rochester Institute of Technology and the Board of Trustee of the Rochester Institute of Technology in Kosovo, I now confer upon you the degree to which you are entitled as certified by the faculty with all the rights and privilege pertaining thereto. Congratulations, class of 2020. Whatever you choose to be and wherever you go, be proud of your roots. Be proud of who you are and remember that you are an RIT Tiger and are always welcome to your university home. Here's to you, class of 2020. Cheers. Once more, we're looking forward to see you soon in campus for traditional commencement ceremony. Stay strong and be safe. Goodbye. Dear class of 2020, congratulations on your graduation. You've worked really hard to reach this day. I hope that your time at RITK has helped shape your values and your perceptions. Please remember, no matter where life takes you, always take time for yourself. Once again, congratulations. Congratulations, graduates of 2020. You've made it through the Triwizard Maze and you've done it well, and we are proud. The challenges you will face are also opportunities. Opportunities to do something for yourself, opportunities to do something for your community, and opportunities to do something wonderful for the world. And we hope that you'll come back and you'll demonstrate how what you learned here was only the beginning and that you've always continued learning. Congratulations, class of 2020. Let's all take a breath, enjoying this moment of celebration. What an accomplishment. I look forward to celebrating your future successes with you. I'd like to say thank you for such a wonderful experience in the classroom, helping you to learn new skills and also receiving your offerings and learning from you as well. May your future be bright. Be well. You did it. It's done. Congratulations. Uh, it took a lot of hard work to get here. You've earned it. Do you remember one thing from my class? I want you to remember. You try and talk to everyone, but not talking to anyone. But you're going to do great things out there, and I cannot wait to see you. Congratulations, graduate. We're so very proud of you. Now get out your necklace, add a few more pearls of wisdom of your own, and go out there and share them. Remember to always keep your process as beautiful as your product. Go out there and do good work, and we'll see you in the future. Happy graduation, Generation 2020. Congratulations on your hard work. We wish you a great social life and career ahead. And what we mean by this as economists is... May your enthusiasm and positive spirit never run into diminishing return. And that there is always excess demand for your presence. And that your presence becomes a big positive externality. May you always give love and be loved. Ceteris paribus. Congratulations, class of 2020. This is such a great achievement. 
Now go on into what we call the real world and make the most of it. Remember, it depends is not always the right answer, but you can go out there and find the right answers and make them happen. See you all around and keep being amazing. Dear graduates, what a joyous day this must be for all of you. Congratulations on this big achievement of yours. I wish you lots of passion, fulfillment and success in whatever you choose to do next in your life. As you do so, however, remember this from me. Make your existence matter in this world. Dear class of 2020, congratulations. I'm so proud of you. You face a new chapter in your life now, and I want you to know that my thoughts and best wishes go with you. May you enjoy the continued success in the years ahead. Hello, graduates. We are so very proud of you. All the best in the next chapter of your life. Warmest congratulations. So happy to share in the excitement of your graduation and so very proud of you too. Keep up your dreams. Our society needs your knowledge, your courage, and your creative spirit more than ever. Wishing you all the best in your bright futures. A gift is never free, rather always requires exchange. Anthropology 101. So thank you for the questions, the debates, the passion. Congratulations for this incredible milestone, and I look forward to meeting you along the way and paying it back. Congratulations, graduates. Congratulations on your well-deserved success. Keep growing. Keep pursuing your dreams and talent. Today, we're all so proud of you. Keep making us proud. Hello, class of 2020. You've worked hard for the past four years, and we're here to celebrate your success. Congratulations. May we meet in better days. Congratulations, Class 2020. This is a remarkable achievement. Your graduation means that you are now crossing on a new phase of your life. We wish you all the best. Always be courageous, be brave, explore new avenues of life, and always speak the truth. Congratulations, everyone. You did it. You worked so hard to get this far. I want you to be very proud of it. Take a moment to recognize that achievement. Then go out there and make the changes you're brought here to make. I am very excited to be a part of a future where you lead. Hello, dear students. Congratulations on your graduation. It's been an amazing journey. And as you take the next phase of this journey, I'd like you to think about this mysterious quote. If you come to a fork in the road, take it. And until we meet again, students, good luck. Dear graduates, today you are cherishing the fruits of your hard work. I wish that success keeps following you in everything that you do. Today and always, congratulations and happy graduation. Cheers. Hello, graduates. We are here to celebrate you today. Congratulations on your graduation and best wishes for the next part of your journey. I'm proud to have been your professor. I remember all of you as very active and brave, so make sure to keep that spirit up and look forward to your accomplishments and achievements in the future. All the best to you. <laughs>